So you may be asking, why is this sale so important that I had to make a video about it? Well, number one, I sort of contributed personally to make this trade happen. And I sold my golden pen uh, to the guy called Benix, which obviously later bought a Burning Killer exclusive with a lot of items, including my golden pen. And number two, why do I think it is that important of a sale? Well, big sales like this aren't just trades that happen from day to day. It gives the TF2 trading community a huge boost, in my opinion. So remember how the Burning Team Captain was sold? It brought many new people to the game and also to the trading community. And also remember how the Burning Killer exclusive got sold for the first time ever? Well, yeah, uh, that also brought many people in. And I mean, after all, Killer exclusive is the second most expensive item in Team Fortress 2. And this requires some respect, I would say. Also, firstly, I would like to thank Benix, uh, the current owner of the Burning uh, Killer exclusive, for being so kind and taking these screenshots for me. So probably everyone is now curious, what did he buy the Burning Killer exclusive for? Well, let me just show you the trade. Please keep in mind this trade was uh, a really insane deal. I would consider it a huge quick sell myself, so yeah. Uh, he bought it for 3 golden frame pants plus 1000 keys pure. Now, I do realize that there are some other items in the trade, such as the unusual team captain with proper energy effect, but don't get confused, he gave him some keys uh, before this trade actually happened, and after that he basically done the trade. So 3 golden pants, some keys and a team captain, which is worth like 500 keys I think? So yeah, and he basically promised that he'll give him uh, 400 keys pure in like three days or so. So at the end it is basically three golden pans plus thousand keys pure and as you may know a single pan uh, is about 1100 keys pure I think at the moment and times three equals um, to about 3300 keys plus. Uh, the thousand keys he uh, I, I already mentioned so it will all equal to the final amount of at least 4300 keys pure. So yeah, this trade was uh, really insane in my opinion, considering the last valid sale on the Burning Killer exclusive was for uh, 6000 I think 300 keys ish in uh, Got Your Unusuals, which is obviously a lot. And it was about uh, two months ago, so I would say it's actually really recent, so indeed he made about 2000 keys of pure profit doing this trade. But as I said earlier, Benix uh, doesn't care that much about value and this is actually his dream set, so I'm assuming he will keep that for some time at least. And uh, as I said earlier, I obviously know this guy called Benix because I sold a pen to him, but uh, he's pretty much a fresh trader in the community, he's trading only for a short period of time, a few weeks actually, I think. So you may be asking, how did he get so many items, how did he get rich? Well. At first I thought that he's um, basically one of the people who is lucky enough to have a lot of money and uh, he basically invests a lot of money into the game, then cash out um, and turn that into a profit later. So I actually talked to him about this and he actually told me that he's not ever going to cash out and he's not looking for any profit. For obvious reasons, I can even show you the screenshots of what exactly he told me. Anyways, I'm feeling this uh, video gets some kind of motivational vibe or something, but uh, anyways, if you if you got uh, this uh, amazing idea of investing a lot of money in TF2 right now, um, please don't do it. Unless you are a really experienced trader and you know what you are doing, uh, I wouldn't suggest you doing that. So yeah, um, you may be also asking who is an experienced trader? Well. In my eyes, experienced trader is someone who traded up to at least 1000 keys pure, uh, or basically 1000 keys in items, uh, it doesn't really matter that much. But 1000 keys at least, I would say, um, that's what I call an experienced trader. So please again guys, uh, don't invest money into trading. I never invested any money into trading and neither am planning to do so in future. For sure it takes some time to trade up, but it isn't impossible. So yeah guys, um, in conclusion don't invest any money in TF2, I hope I didn't give you an example by uh, recording this video, um, but yeah, I wanted to let you know because uh, this sale is in my opinion really important, it's, uh, it will boost the community a lot. And if there will be actually more people willing to invest uh, real world money into TF2 and buying all these high tier unusuals, I think for sure there will be more interest in TF2 
uh, as a game uh, in future. And also guys, I'm, I'm not sure if I will be able to upload in the upcoming two weeks from now on. So as you may know, uh, school ended today and basically I'm going on holidays and I will be probably there for about two weeks. So uh, expect a lack of content on this channel for at least two weeks. I'm not still sure how this will work, but I wanted to somehow trade uh, as a part-time job uh, throughout the summer. So yeah, expect a lot of uh, trading videos um, on this channel. So yeah guys, um, I am afraid this is all for now. I hope you enjoyed this video. As always guys, uh, if you like this video, make sure to like, subscribe and all that stuff. And I will see you till the next one.